Dragons, I'm Mr. Salerno, and this is Flame, and Henrietta's still with us. We know how much she loves music, and she brought Queen Colleen with her. Hello, Queen Colleen. We're so glad you made it to the show, and we want to welcome you to the News of Camelot. Today's Friday, May 27th, 2022, and another special musical series episode is in the books for you, Queen Colleen. We hope you enjoy it. Before we go on that, dragons, let's hear what Naol has to say. Take it away, Naol. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the, to the republic of which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice. Thanks so much, Naol. We're so glad you led us in the Pledge of Allegiance and the Moment of Silence. Flame, the sun is going to rise today at 5.48. 5.48 in the morning. Queen Colleen, Hen Henrietta, the sun is going to set at 8.25. All the way at 8.25 in the evening, which is great news, Dragons. It's a nice start to the weekend. And you might remember, we've had so many musical treats over the course of this week, which included our school song. And last Friday... We did a little journey to some of the great work that third grade is doing. Today, we're going to highlight fourth grade. And they were inspired by a very special artist named Victor Costa. You should see what Mr. Maxwell and Ms. Kinback have cooking for the entire fourth grade to put music and art into a beautiful symmetry. Check it out, dragons.
you can almost hear the pictures come alive. Right, Queen Colleen, right, Henrietta, right, Flame? They just come alive with all of the focus and the musical talents from fourth grade. So thank you, fourth grade, for all that you do. And thank you to Miss Kinback and Mr. Maxwell for making that possible. Dun -dun -dun! It's time for the birthday box. Well, check this out. You missed it. Queen Colleen, you might have missed it. We read so many June birthdays yesterday, and Henrietta was there for all of it. You're going to believe this, dragons. There are no birthdays today, either. There are no birthdays today. But we have a lot of birthdays starting tomorrow. So let's do birthdays tomorrow and into Sunday, right? Because we won't have school on Monday, so let's do tomorrow and Sunday. So Saturday, May 28th, Daywick Rana. Way to go, Daywick. Happy birthday to you in fifth grade. Garrett Santi, happy birthday, Garrett, in first grade. Nice job, Orion Shaker. All right, Orion, happy birthday to you also in fifth grade. And then on Sunday, on Sunday, Vitor. Vitor has a birthday, Vitor Kilho in sixth grade. Lindley Gear, Lindley, that is so great. We won't say what we have to say. Happy birthday to you, Lindley. Ian Picciarelli. Way to go, Ian. Happy birthday to you in fourth grade. And, hey, Sophia Zarita? No way, Sophia Zarita. That's a first grader. Nice job. That's, what is that, seven dragons in two days. That's kind of fun. Yes, let's. Let's check the mail. Let's check the mail before we have our long weekend. And let's start right here. Maximiliano wrote us a note. And he had a wonderful picture right there. Look at that. Flame is ready for action. Oh, yeah. Probably in his Jordans. Very nice job. Thank you, Maximiliano. And then this is a very long... Look at how long this is, Flame. This is beautiful. What beautiful work. Micah, thank you. And thank you for drawing the school. Oh, Flame. Yeah, just chilling on a beautiful sunny day. Don't flip... Let's not forget the sun. Sorry about that. And then Flynn... Flynn drew a castle. Looks like some sort of a story, and it might even be horizontal. It might be vertical. It's a puzzle wrapped in a riddle. Flynn, excellent stuff. And dragons, as you enjoy your weekend, just know that we will be enjoying Memorial Day and all the people that have lost their lives for our country. We'll have more on that on Tuesday's show, but we hope you are safe. We hope that you understand that the power of your words and your actions lifts people up. So that reminder that you have the power to do this, make someone's weekend great, is in your control, Dragons. Make it happen, put others first, and that's how the goodness spreads throughout the community. So, on behalf of Flame, on behalf of Henrietta, and on behalf of Queen Colleen, I'm Mr. Slerno. Make excellent choices this weekend, Dragon. Be safe. We are very appreciative of everything you do, and we can't wait to see you next week. Thanks, everyone.